The purpose of this video is to introduce the FS10A. Hi, my name is Sam Kresh, and I'm the manager of the Industrial OEM Division at Fluid Components International. The FS10A is a flow monitor designed specifically for analyzers and sampling systems. The FS10A was designed to be used with standard quarter inch tube teeth. In fact, it will fit with 3 8 inch and half inch and, and eighth inch adapters as well. Uh, but also, using an SP76 adapter, it will fit into a standard SP76 manifold. So that we can monitor flows in all legacy systems as well as more advanced SB76. The device is also equipped with 10 LEDs uh, for indication of flow. One of the LEDs will be flashing, indicating where the trip point is set. Uh, it also has a 4 to 20 milliamp output as well as a single pole double throw relay output. Uh, there is an option to replace the relay with a solid state output. In addition to those outputs, there's also a convenient RS-232 for setting up the device using a notebook computer in the field. If that's not available, the buttons are always located on the device for setting as many as 15 functions. Those could include the necessary zero span and trip point, as well as fail-safe settings, hysteresis, time delays, and others. The standard integral configuration may be used in ambient temperatures up to 160 degrees Fahrenheit with process temperatures up to 250 degrees F. Uh, for higher temperature applications, remote mount configuration is recommended. With the remote mount, we can locate the sensor directly in the cabinet and mount the electronics in a cooler area. Uh, the other advantage of a remote configuration, not only temperature, but we can mount the display outside the box where you can conveniently look at the LEDs. In addition to that, you can get an optional RS-232 interface on the outside of this panel, and that makes it convenient to interface the computer PC program. The device comes with a couple of interfaces for the cable. The most convenient being an M12 connection, it's an 8-pin connection. We can supply the cable or the customer may supply their own cable. Um, the other option would be a cable gland with a fixed length. One of the main features of the FS10A is that it can be set up in the field. This is important when one considers that sampling systems can have any number of fluids, any type, any temperatures, they could be liquids, they could be gases and the configurations vary. The advantage of setting it up in the field is that the user knows and can, can be quickly demonstrated that the device is operating in his specific application and his specific installation. In addition to setting the trip point in the field, with the FS10A, we can set the zero and the span. So we optimize the range of operation for the specific fluid of the process. Then we set our trip point and we know that we are operating over the exact range that the sampling system is using for that particular fluid. Note, like all other FCI thermal instruments, there are no moving parts. We simply have two sensors made of Hasselhoy C22. The other wetted parts are normally 316L. We have an option of providing all wetted parts in SOYC 22 as well. In addition to the standard tube T's we discussed earlier, we can adapt injection tubes, getting down to small lines typically used with eighth inch tubing. Uh, in those configurations, we can reach flows in gases down to 10 cc's per minute. Liquids can go very close to zero. In summary, the FS10A, designed specifically for sampling systems, approaches the ideal flow monitor. In addition to the features we discussed earlier, it has Zone 2, Division 2 approval for hazardous locations. And either the integral or the remote can be used to cover most every application 
that may arise for flow monitoring in a sampling system. Thank you for using FCI products. Please refer to the manual for information on additional button functions. The manual and further technical downloads are available on the FCI website at www.fluidcomponents.com.